there are a variety of potential outcomes for those renters right now. Earlier this month, the CDC extended the ban on evictions until October 3rd because of the ongoing pandemic, but the Supreme Court blocked the ban. North Carolina A&T Economics Department Chair Dr. Scott Simpkins says he's not so sure an extension would have made a major difference, though. The CDC's um, uh, extension of the moratorium originally to October um, was was just a month. Uh, so it wasn't a long term solution either. Now landlords can resume evictions. Many landlords have been uh, impacted by the moratorium. There are still several resources for people who need them, including state programs and the Salvation Army. Ever since the pandemic began, uh, we've, we've played a major role um, in the city and uh, in preventing homelessness. Lieutenant Chris Raymer is the Corps officer for the Salvation Army in Greensboro. He says so far thousands of people reached out to them asking for help. We do have a, um, a shelter. We have a our family success center that the United Way uh, um, helps us run, which we're very grateful for. Uh, but we we will be at capacity, you know, and then we have hotel partners that that we partner with. But, you know, hotel putting people in hotels, that's just a it's very temporary. That's um, you know, it's just putting a Band-Aid um, on the on the issue. Because of that, he's concerned for what's to come with the ban now lifted.